Ja, Was von Reinsdorf ist ja. pretty cool. Like it. I like it. So if that was von Reinsdorf, we've done it. Very interesting. So now we're heading to the area of Nivoudwil. I am there's some Urlochs Kloof Nature Reserve or something like that that I want to go and look for over there before we get to Nivoudwil. Like we'll see. The building was 1938. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what the road delivers. Delivers. Can't get in here. It's closed. Oh. Oh, it's all closed. Closed between one and two? Baghdad Cafe is closed. Looks such a vibe. Yeah. That's a pretty. Even the delivery guy standing in front of the gate That's can't get true. in. No, everything is locked. There's a lock on the, the door. Yeah. On the door. I mean, they have a situation because I, I can't imagine them being closed. Yeah. Interesting. Cool symmetry. <laughs> Oh, that's a pretty. It looks a cool place. It does. Look at that. Eh? Sure. Okay. I would have liked to have checked it out. There in the far distance, you can see this road goes up that mountain. That I'm looking forward to. Yeah, it looks stunning. It's called the Van Rains Pass, eh? It, well, there is a Van Rains Pass. I don't know if that's it. I think that might be it. I'm a little closer now, you can see that road going up the pass there, it's crazy. Very windy. Very windy today. But I think it's going to be an awesome pass. Yeah, with a 600 meter climb. 600 meter climb to the top, and they say you look over the Knersflakte from the top. They say it's beautiful, I want to see that. Yeah, it sounds amazing. I'll put it there for me. Top. Yeah, no, that's no problem. I love any pass. Van Rijn's Pass for 8 kilometers. Nice. Looks spectacular, eh? It does, eh? Wow. It reminds me of the Cape Fold Mountains. These it folds, does, right? though. You're right. I love it when they do those folds. I'm starting from the lowest lookout point. I don't know if there are any more at the top there. But wow. Now this must be the Knersflakte, I'm sure. Crazy. You can see forever. There are no words. Look. I'm nearly at the top, but check this out. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Welcome to the Northern Cape. Fantastic. Stunning. <laughs> Look at that, eh? Same. 
lots of baboons, but you won't see them. No, They're the same colour as the rock. really one of the nicer passes, eh? So, we wanted to come into the nature reserve now, but we can't. We need to go and get a permit. So, we're going to have to quickly shoot through to Nivotro, get a permit and come back. So, that's what we're going to do right now. It's very interesting. It's very different. Interesting. We've never done this before. No. Okay. We we'll quickly run in and get the permit. Great. I'll wait for you. Okay. I hope they can help me for the permit. Okay, so we came here to get the permit for the Oorlogskloof uh, Nature Reserve. But apparently um, we came here over lunchtime and they were closed for lunch. So we had to wait a while and come back after lunch. And um, the lady says they can't sell me a permit now. I have to come back tomorrow because it's closed. Um, the nature reserve is closed. It's too late today to go, so we'll have to go tomorrow. So we'll see what it looks like tomorrow. I don't know if we're going to have time. But we'll try and see if we can do it, but I don't think so. Do you know what I'm thinking? I think they cut off a certain time for safety. Exactly. So that if people aren't out by a certain time, they know that I understand there might be that. an issue. I'm disappointed, though, but I'm sure. it is what it is. But let's go find some other interesting things. I saw some weird things in, in this little town. So, so did let, I. Let's, <laughs> let's go. go and check it out. <laughs> Niveau de Vol. So this is the spa. We shall come later. Yes. The Nomad Dentist. Oh, good wow. heavens, babe. They have a travelling dentist. That is insane. I love it. <laughs> Check the post office. Wow. The butcher for the bulldog who shall come later. Yes. Is this is yeah that you said, eh? Yes. I have to go up to this church. Uh, it looks pretty phenomenal. Yes, it does. Wow. Ooh. Wow. Definitely, definitely, definitely. It's your vibe, eh? Look at this church. <laughs> the steeple has little steeples. Yeah. Okay, a few minutes for the bell. Yeah, but for four o'clock. Yeah. It's only two o'clock now. Oh, okay, well, <laughs> two o'clock. It still is two hours ahead, but cool. Yeah, let's hope it goes off. Incredible. Look where one can drive right up to the church here. Real. Unreal. Look at the lead windows. Just want to take a walk around this church. Firstly, look at this bell. Amazing, look at this. <laughs> this is beautiful, eh? old church so it was built in 1906 and yes the organ
this is so old. Look at this. Wow. And the pedals at the bottom. Man, oh man. With the levers. Gold medal, 1911. Organ builders. Look at these old switches and plugs and... Fantastic. And the view of the congregation from the top. Amazing. I'm going to take a walk around the church. Okay, so it was established on the 3rd of February 1906. Marjorie from Mikey's in Van Rijnsdorp, where we had something to eat, said that I must come to this Nivoetville butchery. They make the best bultong she's ever tasted, so got to find out if that's the truth. So we, um, Curtis has gone across the road to buy Biltong, hopefully with a whole lot of fat. And um, yeah, we decided to support local for dinner and we ordered some toasties because we had quite a big lunch. We're not in the mood for any preparation or anything else this evening. So yeah, what a cute little food truck this is. The main road of Nivot. Oh, sorry, Neotor. Earlier I said some weird things, but weird and wonderful. Look at this. Incredible. Someone's got an imagination, eh? Wow. I don't know if any of you remember those old Mad Max movies. This is what that reminds me of. Incredible. I wonder if they ever went, did move. Look at this. It reminds me of Mad Max, eh? Check the spikes on the back. But this is for real, this will hurt you for sure. <laughs> Major spikes. Oh yeah, it's only one door. Crazy. Nitrous oxide. Arm flames. This is a lot being put into this thing. Eh? Wow, sir. Yeah, I'd say this meets with my approval. Love, love, love fatty biltong. So we'll try this out uh, this evening with the toasties. Curtis, I think it's his favorite food in the whole wide world, biltong. And he says the reason for that is that his mom ate biltong a lot while he was in her tummy. <laughs> but I'm sure that's a whole lot of hogwash. <laughs> I don't think that's the reason. Yes, okay, bye. Skane's Cook Palace. Is this what they call the Karoo Donut? Yes. <laughs> or diagonal cake. We had it at uh, Coffee Yellow. Yes, I remember. Check them. This is the Skane's Cook Palace. Mm. Uh, direct translation is the Skew Cake Palace. Ah! <laughs> Skew Cake Palace. <laughs> 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 Skew Cake Palace.
but I make Karu donuts, yeah. yeah. Ik is het is Bye bye. 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 Bye Okay, yes, the botanical gardens. Is it in here? Yep. Okay. Have we gone through to those already? Looks like it. It's amazing how kilometers fly when you're having fun. <laughs> yep. Put on my glasses for these signs. Yes. Office. Parking area. Pretty building, eh? Very nice. Garden office. So I'm gonna go and find out. Yes. So I just spoke to a lady inside the offices here, and she says at the moment there's not much to see. With uh, it's not the right time of the year with the flower season, uh, but it's was the time that we chose to come. So she says I can take a walk down through the botanical gardens and see what I can. What it would imagine what it would look like when I take the route. So let's go look what it looks like. They say all that they ask is that when we go through a closed gate, we must close it again, specifically for the sheep, because you can hear the sheep in the background. But you can see there's absolutely nothing to see now. Trails, these are the trails through this way. Wow, pretty neat work here. Yeah. came to the botanical gardens yeah, at Nivaudville but the wrong time of the year so because we couldn't get into Oorlogs Kloof nature reserve today Sonia found something called the glacial pavement on the Oorlogs Kloof road so we're gonna go and see that apparently it's something to do with where there was a glacier millions of years ago yeah, they say you can see evidence of glacial activity 300 million years ago, which has left ruts in the sandstone rock and is visible to the naked eye. That'll that be, sounds crazy. I would love to see that. That's going to be interesting. Glacial, glacial pavement. Glitzerflur. Wow. Oh, you must walk. You must go through the pedestrian gate. Yes. And you must walk. Okay, dogs. I'm going to do that. Glacial pavement. Let's go. Okay, first through the pedestrian gate in about 200 meters. Now, because one's on farms with sheep and stuff, always keep a gate closed. Look already, yeah, I see it. Look at this. Well, this is what is this what a glacier did to the rocks or the sandstone? Wow, look at this! Incredible. Wow. That's freaky, eh? Easy. Okay, what does this say?
So they were, what they said that the, the ice, the glacier had stone particles frozen into it and this was the sandstone and those stone particles are what grooved, made these grooves into the sandstone. You can definitely see something was scratching it here. This is crazy interesting. And this happened 300 million years ago, when it was still part of the Gondwana continent. was all covered in a glacier and it was when before the continents all split up and this was sliding down just we oh yeah, totally totally different but you can definitely see something was scratching it I thought you would find that amazing They say that the stone fragments that are caught up in the glacier itself are what scratched the sandstone and made those ridges. So that's, that's what it makes sense to me. But you must see the ridges. It, it looks totally out of place. And this was, you remember before the continent split up, it was called Gondwana? Yes. That, now this was still in that time period, before the, the continents even split up. So this this whole picture this this whole place was a glacier and this was the glacier was sliding over the over the rock over the sandstone and it had chunks of stone and rock and stuff and that's what scratched those grooves into it like that really interesting one can't even imagine but that's just just way beyond me especially like 300 million years ago right so it was all ice this was a glacier it was covered in a glacier which is ice ice right? yeah that blue ice which is found in Iceland and Antarctica now. Which is melting now as well. Wow. Real interesting stop at Nivotville. Most definitely. Telling you. Loved it. That was really nice. I enjoyed it, but now it's time to hit the road. Weird and wonderful. Love Weird it. Weird and wonderful. Thanks, Nivotville.